Right, well, I've just received my Revelation RBJT uh, Purple Jazzmaster inspired guitar. Um, really, really cool looking instrument. Uh, plays really nice for the money. Um, I'm really, really impressed. The, the neck is really smooth, nice action already uh, straight out of the box. Uh, the edge of the frets could do with a little, little softening up, but they're uh, no worse than any Mexican Fender or anything like that. Uh, I won't talk for too long. The tuning pegs are crap. They're going to be the first thing I change. Second will be the bridge saddles, uh, mainly because I'm going to get scratched uh, to hell by these um, uh, these saddles. Don't like them at all, so they're going to get changed. I'll give you a little waz, uh, let you know what it sounds like. Um, love the block inlays. Um, the binding on the neck looks really cool. I've got a feeling that's going to be in paint. I really can't tell whether it's proper binding or not. Anyway, I'll give you a little uh, bit of noise. tone selector um, that's pretty cool it goes from kind of nasally to not so nasally really <laughs> Okay, well it's a couple of days later now. I've made a couple of changes to the guitar as I said I would. Um, I've now installed the proper Cluson Vintage Deluxe Tuners. Um, they look pretty much the same as the old ones but feel so much different when tuning and now it stays in tune. So uh, uh, absolutely no disrespect to Revelation. Uh, they, they had to build a budget guitar that um, was going to be affordable. They're not a name that everyone knows, so I don't blame them for putting you know, slightly cheaper parts to, to try and keep the cost down. But these were 30 quid, and it's really changed the guitar. Um, it really sounds um, and plays and feels great. So, um, and I've put the new saddles on. Um, these are relatively cheap, just off eBay. They just I prefer the feel of these. They're, you know, I'm sure they do just the same job as the last ones, but... My hands are not going to get scratched uh, to pieces by the uh, the previous ones. So um, I shall give you a little uh, demonstration. I've now got the uh, whammy bar, which I didn't have last time. So uh, we'll see how it sounds now. I've changed the strings as well. I've put slightly higher gauge. I think it came with nines. So these are now tens on here. So the tremolo is pretty good. I don't really use tremolo a great deal, but uh, absolutely no complaints with this one. It's a nice little action and it stays in tune, no problem. It's a pretty cool guitar, go and get one.